Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Kralis and welcome back to Islands. Just sit back, relax and enjoy. And it's almost exactly two years ago since we did a 42 episode long series when the game was still in alpha and early access. And up to this date, it still remains one of my most favorite series that I've ever recorded. I'm going to link the playlist down below if you guys want to check it out. Because the adventure which we embarked on was absolutely breathtaking. No, you guys are breathtaking. But about two weeks ago, the game launched out of early access and also became free to play. So it's available on Steam, Windows Store and mobile. So make sure you check out the links in the description if you guys want to play. Also, a big shout out to Bohemia Interactive, the creators of Islands, for sponsoring this video. So Bohemia, Thank you so much. And before we do a quick base tour from our first playthrough, let me show you Islands. So what is Islands? For those who are brand new to the game, let's try to sum it up with a few words. To me, Islands is a survival, crafting, building and exploration game. But it's so much more. And in the free to play version of the game, let me show you what's included. So we have the sandbox included, which is pretty much a huge island where you can just go creative with your ideas and create the empire of your dreams. And don't let your dreams be dreams. Just do it. We also have the ability to create and play mini games. So you can create a mini game and share it with the community. You can share it with your family, friends, the world. You can even share it with your pets if you desire. And we also have an editorial mode. So we have sandbox included, mini games included, and editor mode. One thing which is not included is the exploration mode, which is pretty much a survival uh, part of the game. It is available as a DLC for about, don't quote me, but I think it's around 20 euros, 20 American dollars or something. And this is pretty much you start off with nothing, an island, and you gather stuff, you create stuff, you craft stuff, you make a ship or a boat and sail and explore all the islands around you. I love that, by the way. But let's just see Playlands. This is something new which I haven't seen even. Welcome to Playlands. Join our incredible world, play funny mini games with others, get XP, dress up your character to your heart's desire. I see, I see. And if I just click all the games over here. Oh, okay. So we have some of the mini games over here, like Monster Horde. That is a nice farmhouse. Kind of reminds me of one I did. But we also have. Um, all the like blueprints here as well, I believe. Like a Mustang GT, which you can download and put it in your own save. <laughs> New Russian land with a cat. I don't even know. Oh, was that a Ferris wheel? Adorable. But first thing we're gonna do, we're just gonna try to remember the first playthrough. So let's let's just do a little base tour of what we've done in the past. This brings back so many memories. So I guess everything started up in that house up on top. And we did kind of remodel the house quite quite drastically. There was a house, like it was a like a game created structure over here. But we did remove that and created this. <laughs> I got a big smile on my face. I've spent so many hours in the, Yeah, this is my bedroom. Like throughout the whole playthrough, I slept on a little uh, thingy <laughs> on, on the ground. I never got to have a bed even. But yeah, so it all started over here. And then we just started expanding upon, upon from that. Like, there's so much to this game as well. Like, there's so many items. So many, like, crafting stations. No way! There we go. <laughs> it still works. This is incredible. Ah. Ah. Okay, so then we have the farmhouse. It is maybe just too, too bit of a red color of it. But everything has taken so much time. I remember we tried to br bring horses back and we totally failed on that. I think we brought maybe one horse back and then just died somewhere about. Because we didn't have any horses on this island. We had to bring them from another island with our little ferry. And it didn't really work out at all. Street lights. You have no idea how many hours I've spent on this map just digging out sand and landscaping. Oh man, those rocks. Oh yes, this is something I was really proud of back in the day. Uh, okay, where am I? Where am I going? Over here. We've made this little electricity room with the levers over here. There we go, force field deactivated. This was this was not, never really completed, but we had all the juice available. Because this is all the like, uh, there's um, there's power source, I think, behind it, or maybe somewhere in the tunnels, which uh, goes to, to this thingy. And then we have all those power connections, and they're just 
<laughs> I don't know. This is like electrical cables <laughs> drawn across the base all over the place. Oh, man. This might be uninteresting for some, but to me, this just brings back memories and it also shows the game's potential. Oh, the warehouse over here, which we had all the guns. Look at all those guns and the shoppy outside. Oh, the paint gun. Like, uh, oh, look at the shoppy little restaurant we've made ourselves. And then we have the beautiful art gallery over here. But look at this. Okay, close your eyes. <laughs> I don't know. I think we maybe failed on the, on this a little bit. Okay, that's not how I'm supposed to say it, but I said anyhow. Yeah, we made it a little bit too bright, I believe. Um, but uh, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Man. All the, all the stuff and findings we've been gathering across the lands when we've been exploring. And I can't wait to like load up a new map. And explore like the, the new new stuff they've added to the game. Little boat houses. And my favorite, one of my favorite creations, the Black Earl. Not Pearl, this is the Black Earl. It's it's definitely maybe not the hottest ship around uh, these these days, uh, time and age. I believe people made uh, much more better creations creations than this. But back in the days, I was super proud. This was the flagship. Of, of islands. Okay, we'd also have the... Oh, you know what I think they did? I think they've actually changed... Okay, bad weather is coming. Bad weather is coming. I think they changed how... Um, how those operate. <laughs> Our RV! No flipping way! Look at this! Can you see the possibilities? Like... That's amazing. Can I... There we go. I, you know what? I'm surprised. I haven't played this in two years, and I just like, load up the save, and everything just just works. Yeah, I think they've changed how how vehicles operate on um, on uh, on ferries because we made this like a uh, car ferry, and it didn't really work out back in the day because it kind of like was a little bit wonky. But I think that it has changed, and then we have the lighthouse. Like this base has no purpose at all. Oh yes, let's not neglect uh, this, the treasure room. I did kind of clear off uh, quite a bit of it, uh, but this is where we kept all the findings from the from our expeditions. Guns, books, paintings, <laughs> swords, <laughs> gold, even, <laughs> I don't know, skins. <laughs> Man, ah, this was, uh, this was one fine car back then. I never got to use the cars that much, because obviously I live on, on, on a mountain, kind of ish. The workshop. <laughs> Man, okay, I'm, I'm happy. This definitely brings, brings back memories, tons of memories. And where's the, all the flying shark? You might be, what is a flying shark? Back in the day, it was flying sharks literally all over the place. Now, not so much. This is not even mine. This was generated. And this is where we steal the power from, by the way. <laughs> yes, indeed. Because that is how we roll. But ladies and gentlemen, let's uh, let's let's do something. I do want to try out a uh, new ability to to edit stuff in the editor uh, editorial mode. So one thing which I really want to do back in the day, not back in the day, maybe maybe uh, all the bushes, all the stuff, all elevation, so much landscaping. Oh, there's a little brewing station over here as well, all intact and fully functional. And uh, not long ago. Uh, I made a house in Minecraft, which I was really proud of. It was like a modern beach house type of scenario. And I do kind of want to reproduce that in islands. So this is how it looks. How about this? Okay, it might not be exactly as the picture, but I flip and adore this. I love it. Even Black Earl is here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. And one thing which I saw straight off is that, can you guys see the islands in the distance? Well, obviously you can, right? But back in the day when I played it two years back, that was not a thing. You couldn't see islands like this. What you saw was birds and you followed the birds. Maybe you found an island. So you could be gone days lost on um, out on sea without finding an island. Now this makes life much easier. So we're gonna take Black Earl and uh, do some island hopping very soon. But what goes, goes for the house, um, yeah, it's not much done. There's no inside done. But I just wanted to try out and I have to say, the new... What is this? Lizard? 
That is something yet which I haven't seen yet. Ew. Oh, I did see this over here. Because uh, obviously on the map there's like little structures which are like, oh, that's a nice find. But uh, those, uh, those lizards, that's the first time I see them. <laughs> Such a pretty game. <laughs> Such a pretty game. But those who saw the Minecraft Treehouse tutorial, this is how it looked. Well, similar, okay? This is a whole different game, but uh, there's not, no, no interior done. But there are so much possibilities to get the interior done as well with all the furniture uh, which exists in the game. But this is how it looks. We even have a little car garage over here with the two cars we, we created. Back in the day, they're just standing here looking. That's not a garage door, but I don't even care. And inside, oh yes! Ho, ho, ho! Christmas is coming. Ladies and gentlemen, Christmas is coming. Upstairs we have, well, basically two rooms. Can you just imagine having a bedroom over here? Just overlooking the beautiful ocean outside. Then we can have, I don't know, what would we have? Even beam work done in the, in the ceiling. So I'm going to show you how the editor mo mode works. Because it is kind of like building with Legos. And it is just so pleasant and so relaxing. Even though it takes time. Believe me, this has taken, I don't know, maybe 5-6 hours to complete. I kid you not. <laughs> I've just been spending 5-6 hours just constructing this. But I love it. Ah, <sighs> Just look at this. We can't really make water. There was a thing back in the day, but that has been removed because they're working on a new way the physics, the water physics work. So that has been temporarily removed, but it's going to be implemented again in 2020 with a new patch. So yeah, that is not a thing yet. So I had to make the house here on the on the coastline just to get the pool water. And as you can see now, it is... Um, it is... Uh, it is... It is behaving a little bit oddly. That is horses! Goats? That hasn't been in a game before. Goats? Is... Is you new? Okay. Oh, look at that. I believe that over there is an ice biome. Because it looks... Uh, it looks a little bit cold. Hi! <laughs> How did I not see you? <laughs> They've implemented a AI. A hermit. What do you need to know? Nothing! Um, exploration? Uh, Island Tears Biomes. Okay, this is kinda neat. I didn't even know they've implemented uh, people like this. This is awesome. How? Okay, he kinda blends in. Or she, he. Let me see. Might be a he, but I'm not gonna be the, the, the guy who kinda like puts a gender on a, on a mushroom. But, uh, but yeah, I didn't even see, it just blends in. So this over here is the editor, and this is a complete game changer, at least for me, because I love constructing stuff, I love building stuff, and this just makes the world so much easier. Like, obviously you can do the same things in uh, in the sandbox mode using the tools you have, but this is just so much more convenient and, and easier. Like, we have all the, like, for example, game logics, so, like, if you want to do, like, mini games, you have them over here, you can have the, all the entities, like, we have all the building blocks, materials, we have animals, like people even we just had a, a person over here like hello who this a mummy okay this might be a little bit dangerous but we're gonna see because we're gonna load out the game we're gonna take uh, earl and get out on a little expedition somewhere about we also have all the vehicle parts like this i haven't even seen this this is a catamaran okay i'm not gonna be adding a bunch of stuff but this is something oh my goodness islands I've missed out on stuff, I guess. But yeah, so this is how you pretty much build. Like, let's say we want to have, like, roof pieces. So you pretty much select a roof piece and then you get the piece. And you can pretty much just dra drag and drop them like this. But as you can see, like, the pieces are kind of tiny. So obviously, uh, this whole uh, place does consist of uh, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of different pieces. We even have this little fireplace inside, which... There was small campfires, but obviously they kind of kind of went out, so it doesn't make a lot of cozy scenario. But just so you get the the idea, right? And when it comes to furniture, like there there's so much to it. There's there's really like a honey badger hide. When did you add a honey badger into the game? An iron bed that might kind of be suiting for like a dungeon scenario, but uh, yeah, yeah. There's there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff, and this editor mode, as I said. 
for me at least, this is a complete game changer, okay? There's a glitch in the matrix. We need to fix that. Let's see. Oh, a double block. Sometimes it happens, I guess, because I've been copying, pasting, copying, pasting, copying, pasting, dragging, dropping, dragging, dropping. But, uh, but yeah, so this is how you build. You just pick an item. Like, uh, let's just say we're going to build ourselves some plastic blocks. This is this is how it works. So you can just copy that creation. You can mark multiply objects, copy them and drag them away and just create stuff. It, it does take time. Don't, don't get me wrong. It does take time to make something like look uh, something decent. I'm not saying this is decent, by the way, because you can't really say that about your creations, I guess. But uh, it is a complete game changer. And then you can also do the, the terrain painting, for example. So yeah, and then we have all the, the, the land sculpting, so we can add terrain, remove terrain, flatten terrain. Like for example, we just get a big brush and let's just go from here and then just go in here. Yeah, so that is how that operates. We also have the paint, the tool for everything we we see over here. So I've been painting the walls white and whatnot. It's fantastic. I'm going to save the game now. I'm going to get back into that. We're going to sail to... Oh, I can't even see the islands from here. But let's start with that island which was over here. But first we're gonna see what happens with the human NPC and the mummy. Hey! No! Do like BFFs! Hello! Hello, human! NPC! And we treat stuff! I do have the Santa vision. I'm not sure what it is, by the way. We'll put it on and check it out, Kralis. I will. What does we do? Oh, maybe if I... No. I'm gonna get my Santa hat. I'm gonna maybe try to figure out this later on. But look at those guys. They're like BFFs. Get my hammer. Slain. Can I... Sir? I guess I'm not... Oh, he's not hostile because obviously I'm kind of like in semi-creative mode. So... There we go. Ooh, presents. Uh... NPC? No, 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 let's not. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take the black girl, which is just standing here. Well, maybe not standing, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I haven't been here in such a long time. No way! I did it, I did, I forgot about this. The captain quarters with all the like maps and whatnot. Treasure chests all the way around. Guns. And we do have the bedroom up here as well, yeah. <laughs> Ah, okie dokie. Uh, let me see, is the anchor in? I believe it is. Yes, it is. So let's rise the anchor. Uh, how did you do? Okay, 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 okay. Calm down. Don't tell me the storm is coming. It kind of looks a little bit bad for us. But we're going to be sailing the seven seas. Or maybe wait until tomorrow. Yeah, you know what? Let's sleep until the morning. And anchor corrals. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a professional. There we go. Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> I'm speechless. They've made this so so beautiful. I don't remember this being this nice. By the way, for the record, I do have a sore throat, so you have to excuse me, all right? I'm doing my best here. I'm doing my best. Let me just sleep a little, little bit. Can I just go like uh, there? We go. Leave. Perfect. Now we can see. It's still a little bit like um, stormy outside. Kind of seems like. But uh, let's just boom boom and uh, sails away. <laughs> Off we go. The maiden voyage of the. No, it's not. The, the, the black girl has been on so many voyages before. Okie dokie. Can I zoom out? Yes, I can. <laughs> like a kid in the candy store. <laughs> it's been a while since I did this, okay? So you have to excuse me. One thing which is super awesome is, okay, let me just kind of like adjust towards the island over here in the distance, like I saw, like I saw. One f thing which is, okay, Kiraz, don't do it. I'm doing it. There's, usually you can find treasures uh, hidden underneath the surface and how do you, how you find them is to find some floatsome on the surface and if you find floatsome on the surface, you will find treasure beneath, or treasure beneath is lurking somewhere about. And um, I'm not sure they've changed that, but at least before that was the case. So if oh, so if we see any like flotsam 
on the surface, like planks or piece of clothes and such. We will dive... Oh, no, 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 no. We will dive down. I'm wondering, because I think they've even... Okay. Oh, I'm all over the place. I think they've actually added the new biomes as well. But the black girl... So majestic. I think we might be missing some blocks down here. Or maybe not. Nope. That should be all fine. It might be, but, but why do we have a yellow door? For those who haven't watched the previous uh, playthrough, that was our shark killing platform. Yes. I'm going to show you that in a second. I'm not sure we have any sharks about. What is this uh, island? I'm going to get lost. Do we have a map? Yes, we do have a map. So we're sailing towards this island. Ho, ho, ho! I see creatures, I see animals. Is that horses? Okay, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna park a black girl like so. Get the sails. Half speed, Captain! Aye aye! No, 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 no. There we go. And let's get the anchor in over here. Boom! Stop! We have no flipping way! This is what I mean. Oh, there's something over here in the distance. There's uh, camels in the game. No! You have to be kidding. Is that rhinos? Is that the southern African rhino? White rhino? It is. I've met one of those guys in the San Diego Safari Park. Up close and personal. Maybe that's just the, the white rhino. No, they can like sing. Maybe they've implemented it into the game. Who knows? But that is ostrich. <laughs> okay, this is beautiful. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill you. I want to kill you. Look at black girl being all majestic on the horizon. Um... Camel? Can we ride camels? Oh, I'm inside of camel. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is this might be a very awkward video. But you know what? I haven't been in the game for such a long time. And obviously what you do, you bring up your HUD and you start creating, like, gathering stuff. We get a potato added, a little bit of hay, we have bushes, we have this and this and that, and then you create stuff. But this over here... What is this? Uh, there are so many rhinos. It's a little bit dangerous, I guess. Oh, it's a target practice thingy. Oh. Well, that's nifty. Uh, hello, is, do you do the same, sir? No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You run away. Oh, those guys are bad guys. But nothing's going to kill me because obviously I'm in creative mode. Can I, can I nice and nifty? Return tomorrow. Ooh. Ooh. There's a note. Can I, can I, can I read this note? Uh, hmm. Maybe. Ooh. Oh, it's locked. Hmm. Interesting. Well, somebody just found a cave system filled with horses. Okay. Okay. No, no more scenario, I would poop my pants, because those guys, they ain't friendly, okay? But since I'm in creative mode... Ooh. Gone forever. That is Wallandium, I believe, or whatever you pronounce that. That is used to make the power generators and such. Yikes! Not the best way for exploration, but weather nevertheless. <laughs> this is so sweet just seeing those. Hello, person! Is th have you... G Hello? Who this? Uh, cactus worshipper. Why would you worship your cacti? Take that! Okay, that was a douche move. I'm sorry, sir. I'm so, so, so sorry. Ah, it's a new day on the seven seas. Oh, it's it's a much better day for expeditions. But I'm going to be sailing. Let me see. So we came from that island over there, right? So let's go to this one and we'll see what, what this takes us. I just I just mainly just want to showcase the game a little bit for you guys. Especially if the new peeps uh, just joining in. I'm looking for flotsam. Because it would be kind of cool finding a treasure in this video as well. But uh, it is not easy to spot it. 
I wonder what that is. It kind of looks the same as this one. It might be it might be a desert biome as well. This is a huge like I believe this is a tropical island. The same as oh by the way, have they have are the sharks gone? I haven't yet seen the sharks. They are terrifying. I I flipping hate the sharks. What can we find? No way! Ah, ladies and gentlemen, stop it! Stop it! The black girl! No! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, let's get the anchor down like so. As you see over here, there is floatsome, which means there is a little treasure underneath. So if we just dive down over here, oh yes, it is. There's one of those. Uh, remember what was this? Like a base. Can I get in here? Oh yes, scuba gear. Kiraz, you have the cube. You can pretty much just get whatever you want. I know, I know. But let's get all the scuba gear, cause why not? Oh man, workbenches, beds. Screw. Do we find anything? Nope. It is pretty much empty over here. And potatoes. Ay, 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 ay. You know what? I'm not even scared. Because the black girl. We've seen worse. We've seen much worse. This is just a broken bot. With a knot. And let me see. Does it say? Minus form and letter. Read. It looks like we return no more. Fleet carrying us home with plenty of various oars we mined was caught in a storm and shipwrecked. Ew. Don't. Oh. Oh. Does that mean. What is that? Some claws and a little axe. Oh, pickaxe. It get... Well, I guess we can take the pickaxe because why not? Uh, maybe not. Is there anything in this? Let me see. Nope. So what that means? What does it mean, Gerales? I'm thinking, is there a shipwreck somewhere about? Okay. There might not be. But if we can find some, like, surface debris... This is such an unforgiving place, by the way. <laughs> no way! You did not see... Um, you know what? That is going to be cut out from the video. That is not going to be included whatsoever, because I love penguins. Penguins are the best. Imagine being in, like, Super Survival and just finding this. Like, I mean, there are so many goodies inside of this, this building. Like... Yeah. This is not shabby. That is uh, one great find. However, I'm a little bit like this shipwreck. Where can it be? What is that? Like Viking shields? Oh, look at this, this, this face as well. Iron spears? Can I pick up the shields, by the way? Oh, crossbow bolts. Robes. <laughs> What's the bad stuff has happened? They're horn helmets. Ladies and gentlemen, where is it? Over here. Boom! Got it. Hey, hey! Come back, you big guy. Okay. Just because your friend ran away, okay? <laughs> Have you seen something this beautiful? Beautiful sunset, the face of Earl in the back of the year, the Santa hat on Keralis, and then just sailing. I'm uh, lost for words. Just look at this. Okay, it's getting skitty. I know it's getting skitty. And I don't think we're going to find anything. Maybe we will. Who knows? The night is here. Hopefully you guys like enjoyed this video. And hopefully like I showcase the game. Especially like for new players. 
The building aspect in this game is absolutely incredible. Like you just saw the base when we started, like all the possibilities that gives you. The vehicles and the... Oh, I just want to check out the new boats as well, the catamaran thingy. But, uh, but yeah, let's just try to not to crash with the pier. Okay, half sails, captain. I wish we could find more treasure. There's got to be some treasure around the island as well. Okay. Slowly, slow, slow. Oh, okay. oh captain. Yes. Like, uh, you know what? I can park. Can you? Yes, okay. Well, are we moving? Come on. Anchors down. No. Ha. <sighs> Boom. Oh. <laughs> so beautiful. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Islands, and there's so much more to it. It's really hard to showcase in the game in just one video. So do check out the, the series uh, playlist, which I posted in the description, just to get an understanding how beautiful this game is. And let me know what you guys think about the house. Like, it is kind of representing the same house, but in my opinion, this is much more prettier. You can just imagine just decorating this on the inside. Just grabbing, like, for example, let's see here. Uh, let's go into kitchen. Do we have kitchen? I believe we, oh, kitchen counters. Yeah, look at this. Like, okay, where would the kitchen be? I would maybe have it over here somewhere on this wall. I'm not gonna build a kitchen now, but just gonna show you that. Oh, no, 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 the things. And yeah, we can cook. And obviously, we could paint it as well, right? Because if I just take the paint tool, let's say I would. Okay, might not be the best color, but the brown it is. Just love it. Just love this little Christmas tree. I like this. I like. I love this feature. Like you know, having like a couch here, and then just seeing that down there. The bedrooms up here. Yeah, I'm a simple man. I'm a little bit of a nerd as well when it comes to like buildings uh, and just making your base. Making bases is the one thing which I love the most. And I'm super intrigued. We found uh, the mushroom person. It's like. How did I miss that person? The only bummer is that we didn't find, find enough treasure around here. And I'm sure, like, usually when I remember, when I played this the first playthrough, there was tons of treasure just outside your island. Or outside the islands. It's just a matter of finding the little debris pieces. And uh, they're just tiny on the surface. So obviously it's really hard. It's kind of like, I don't want to give up. I want to find more treasure. I can't get enough. <laughs> But I'm, I'm gonna say goodbyes. Like, don't forget, there's tons of mini games as well. So do check them out in the free to play version. But this is uh, this is how the survival uh, aspect looks. You gather stuff, you build stuff, you thrive and survive. I'm still surprised we haven't seen any sharks. They might have removed them from the game. Cause usually they were like all over the place. I think my episode one, when I played it in the in the series, I got eaten by a shark, instant eaten by a shark. Or maybe not, I can't remember. But it was bad anyhow. So ladies and gentlemen, I am Kuralis. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. Let me know what you think about the, the game. Let me think what you think about the house. And obviously, let me know what you think about the beautiful Black Earl. But hopefully I showcase the game as good as possible. I'm, uh, I'm just saying ho, ho, ho. Have a very, very nice Christmas. And sorry about my voice today. I'm a little bit, I'm having a sore throat. So it's making this a little bit hard to talk and, uh, and such. But hopefully I made that as a good job anyhow. So uh, let me just do this. Bam, 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 bam. Have a very, very, very nice day. Kerals were out. This has been Islands. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye. Don't forget, check out the links in the description, all right? And Bohemia Interactive. Thank you so much once again for sponsoring this video. Bye, everybody.